Today I have the pleasure of speaking with Dr. Francis Dubé of Zen Graphene. How are you today? Very well, Tracy. Really happy to be here. You know, we're here at PDAC, and I was just mentioning you were a shareholder. Like the company so much, you stepped in as co-CEO. Is that correct? It's correct. Uh, again, I've always loved the asset, been involved for over five years, and I just really got involved last year. Can't wait to get this company launched again, and we're doing fantastic things. Um, PDAC is really well timed for us to do it this year. And of course, you've got the electric car, the battery materials with graphite, but you also have graphene. Graphene is actually where our entire focus is on because of the applications that are coming to us. Every week right now, there's a new applications for graphene. So the market's in front of us. Um, it's a new revolution, and we're at the right time in the right place right now, and we can't be more excited about where we're at. Well, I agree with you that you're at the right time and right place, but you're a bit of a sci-fi thriller with what graphene is. So if you wouldn't mind talking to the cannabis market out there, they're looking to expand your portfolio. Graphene is something you should be looking at. Can you tell them why it's so exciting? Graphene is like the new plastic, the new steel. It's, it's, it was discovered in 2004. Uh, the guys got Nobel Prize for it for physics in 2010, and since then it's just taken off. Ford's using it now. We're starting to see a real industrial revolution based on this material, and the sky's the limit with what this thing can do, really. So why Zen Graphene? I've got a bunch of money. I'm gaming right now. <laughs> I've made a lot of money in the cannabis market. I'm moving into Graphene because it's so cool. But why Zen Graphene? What's the competitive advantage? There's two things. Really, we have a unique source of graphite in Ontario that is like no other on Earth. It's a very large uh, resource. We'll have decades of production from it. But the other side that's really exciting is we've got 10 different universities in Canada researching and applications for our graphene. The, uh, what we're able to do with graphene is exploding, and we're really at the forefront, cutting edge on the scientific front as well. So we've got the complete vertical integration from the ground to the final integration product into uh, consumer use. So we're very excited about that. It's a very great opportunity for us. So what's the most recent news that you've been most excited about? Honestly, we got all the permits and all the funding to do our bulk sample. So we are actually in Hearst right now doing the bulk sample, a thousand tons. We're going to have about 40 tons of graphite from that. We're going to be able to uh, get into the graphene space this year. And we're very excited about that. So what should we as shareholders anticipate in this upcoming spring? Really, we want to unlock the value of this deposit. So we're doing two, th three things. One, we've got to finish our metallurgy, which we're working on right now. We're hoping to have some news on that very shortly. After that, we've got to talk about how we're going to scale up our graphene production. So we've been working with some of the best people in, the, in Canada and in the world on how to scale up graphene production. So that'll be the key to unlocking it. And then getting our markets uh, scaled up. So we're doing all those three boxes. And as we do those three things, the value that we're going to build throughout the rest of the year should be fantastic for our shareholders. Well, we're looking forward to seeing what happens with Zen Graphene next. Thank you so much. Thank you for your time, Tracy. Appreciate it. Love being here.